guys, it's Janelle here, also known as Chow Chow 808. Today I'm going to be reviewing Burberry's new liquid lip velvets. If you're interested, keep on watching. So if you're new to my channel with express reviews, these reviews are short, simple, and straight to the point. If you're interested in more in-depth reviews and explanations and pictures, definitely check out my blog chowchow808.com. So we're going to start off this express review with the packaging because I have to say I've never really had a brand name product. And so I have to say this packaging is a lot more different than what I'm used to. You get a thicker plasticky bottle, plastic bottle and it's opaque, which is very different from most other bottles that I get that are plastic. It's very, it's see-through, you can see it, it's clear. But this is like a frosty, opaque plastic bottle and it is tapered at the end to look like an actual lipstick and the Burberry cap is just like a lot of their other products with the typical Burberry, I don't know what this pattern is called. I don't wanna say plaid, cause it's not. But it has this typical Burberry pattern on it that a lot of their lipsticks and other products have. So the one thing that caught my attention though when I first started using the product was the applicator. It is an extremely flimsy applicator, which surprised me because I was expecting something a little bit on the stiffer side, that's what she said um <laughs> then like the color pop applicators those are a lot stiffer and they just give you more control but surprisingly even though that even though this is very flimsy i do have a lot of control with it but i don't know if you'll be able to tell i've already swatched this tons times like you can see all the give that the applicator has now that just took me by surprise because i was not expecting that so let's talk about the formula the formula is so lightweight it is great it lasts all day and i just love it even when i reapply it it just looks flawless i am wearing it right now but i was using a staining lip product throughout the day so unfortunately this look right here it's a little bit skewed to the more redder side it's actually more of like this darker rose color this deep or the darker deep rose color so like i said the formula is amazing on this it is so lightweight it actually feels like my lips and i don't feel like it has any pull at all when it as it dries it just feels so comfortable it is not like a liquid lipstick at all with liquid lipsticks you tend to feel the dryness and it pulling as it dries but this is just so comfortable that even after wearing it for so long it still feels like a moisturizing and it, but the only thing that I did notice though was that when I do purse my lips together it does feel a little gritty at times but I can get past that because the color and the wear is absolutely amazing so you saw me swatching the product here and you may be wondering what is this that I have swatched on my well I picked up this product because I really wanted to compare it to the NARS Velvet Lip Glides. And I used to swear by this for so long because I love the color and I just love the formula. The only thing I really hated about the formula was the feel afterwards. I felt like I had to constantly put on lip balm for the next three days after using it just once. But the thing is is that this applicator is so much better than the burberry one it's flat and it's stiffer so you have so much more control than you do with the burberry one but overall i do have to say i love this burberry one a lot the wear is just so amazing and the thing though that you have to be cautious about is that it can accentuate any dry spots that you have so as gross as it sounds but if you have any flaky parts on your lip it's going to accentuate that so you're going to want to use some type of lip scrub or lip exfoliator before going in with this or you just want to make sure your lips are really moisturized before you put the burberry product on so so if I had to choose between the NARS or the Burberry, which one I would invest my money in, I would definitely have to say the Burberry is the winner. I love the formula and I love how it wears and how it wears off, which is really important to me. When I'm going through an eight hour day and sometimes even a 16 hour day, I really want something that's just easy to use and easy to wear and it wears off evenly. And this does it all. I am so in love with it. I. I'm so tempted to pick up more colors, but it is kind of expensive. It's, I believe, $38. So it's not the cheapest product to, to get, but I think it's definitely worth it. If you're looking for a color that is going to be like your everyday use color for every event, every single anything, 
you're gonna want to invest in the Burberry one over the NARS unfortunately to me the NARS just can't compare I hope you guys enjoyed this express review again if you're interested in a more in-depth review or want to see close-up pictures check out chowchow808.com if you've tried Burberry's new liquid lip velvets go ahead and leave me a comment down below letting me know what your thoughts and opinions are and what color you got I want to know what the colors look like on everybody else also don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram all at chowchow808 808 and until my next video I'll see you guys later bye